Now we are going to take start with the rest of the three uh, numericals left, fifth, sixth and uh, seventh. Okay, let me read the statement of the uh, question number five. It says, uh, water waves with wavelength 2.8. Yes, what is wavelength? 2.8. Look, it's written over here. And uh, then it says, produced in a ripple tank, travel with a speed of 3.0 or 3.80 meter per second. Yeah, speed of waves is given to you. That is V is equal to 3.8. Zero. Okay. Uh, then what is required? What is the frequency of the straight vibrator that produced them? Means you need to find out the frequency. Okay. And uh, we know that according to universal wave equation, the basic equation which relates speed of wave, frequency and wavelength that is V is equal to F lambda. We are needed with F. We need to find F. What we do? We divide lambda on both sides. So we get uh, F is equal to V by lambda the value of v is 3.80 lambda value is 2.8 when you do call when you do cancellation with the help of calculator you can get 1.36 hertz means the frequency will be 1.36 hertz which is your required result okay now uh, uh, starting with the question number six it says distance between consecutive crusts in a series okay it says uh, the distance between consecutive crusts in series of water uh, waves travel is 4.0 meters. 4.0 meters means wavelength given to you is 4.0 meters. Okay. And crust travel a distance of 9.0 meter in 4.5 seconds. Okay. Distance traveled is 9.0 means uh, we know that speed of wave formula is distance by time. Distance over here is over here is 9.0 and time is 4.5. So what we do? We put that in the speed of wave equation. That is V is equal to 9 by 4.5. So you get 2 meters per second. So speed value is 2.2 meters per second. What is the frequency of the wave? We are needed to find F. Okay, what we do again the same equation we will use uh, universal wave equation V is equal to F lambda. We need to find F dividing lambda on both sides. We get F is equal to V by lambda. The value of V is 2. Lambda is 4. Just divided you can get 0 0.5 hertz. Okay, the frequency will be 0 0.5 hertz. Done or yeah? Okay, fine. Now coming up with the last numerical of the first chapter. It says a station broadcasts an AM waves whose frequency is 1, 2, 3, 0 into 10 to the power 3, 3, uh, 3 hertz. Okay, uh, find the distance between the cr uh, adjacent crust in each wave. Okay, the distance, uh, okay, what is given and what is required, let's discuss over here. Frequency of AM is given to you that is 1, 2, 3, 0 into 10 to the power 3 hertz. Okay. Frequency of FM given to you is 91.9 into 10 to the power 6 hertz. And this is one of the understood thing which you need to know over here. That radio waves travel with the speed of light. This value is not mentioned in the book. This value is not mentioned in the book. You need to understand it. Okay. You need to memorize it or learn it. Because if the, you don't have this value, you cannot solve the uh, numerical further. Okay. So this is understood value. Right. Speed of wave is V is equal to 3 cross 10 to the power 8 meters per second. Right. Okay. What we are required with? We require distance between adjacent crust. Mean for lambda for AM waves. Similarly, part B distance between adjacent crust, but this time for FM wave. Okay, so both these things we need to find. Do remember one thing: we are solving part number one. So please mention that you are doing part number one because in board examination, students don't write that which part they are doing. Now, so uh, uh, examiners face problem in uh, understanding and checking their. Uh, question so please understand whatever you are doing please 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 mention it okay since we know that universal wave equation v is equal to f lambda and lambda is equal to v by f okay now now coming towards for fm waves what we will do we will write lambda behind uh, like uh, slight below we will write am just to mention it and over here with a uh, uh, slight below to f we will write am right okay the value of v is 3 cross 10 to the power 8 value for am uh, frequency is we are having use calculator and get the result of 243.9 meters right okay now coming towards part number b for fm waves what we do the value for uh, uh, the value for speed 
we are having uh, uh, v is equal to 3 cro uh, across 8 meters per second that is fine okay we can write it like this over here as well lambda fm is equal to v divided by f fm the value of f v we have we are putting over here that is 3 cross 10 to the power 8 meters per second and value for fm frequency already given over there so just put from there and you can have the result of 3.27 meters so which is the required value for fm waves for lambda or wavelength right so this was the end of numericals of chapter number one hope you have enjoyed it thank you for uh, thanks for watching jazakallah